Hey guys, welcome back, Carter. Bits be tripping. It's been at least a week. I mean, I know it, it sucks, bro. I've been trying to get some content to you guys, but we have so much going on. And I wanna bring you guys through some of what's going on here and take you through how we made some changes. We got a couple of A6 running. We got another container here at the studio. It's a fourth container and we're working through our stuff. And I'm gonna take you guys through that nuance of getting a large Bitcoin farm set up. I can't wait to bring you guys that stuff. Um, you guys will see out here. We have made some progress in getting this place organized and cleaned to be able to do some more content for you guys. We've got a couple S19J Pros running, some 3070s running, and we got a lot of rigs ready to get deployed here up back up at the farm as we're optimizing and cleaning and we're going to take you guys through that next week going back up to the farm and then kick starting back off on the immersion stuff as we wait to get the bitcoin containers back up and running but we got a couple cool things coming so we got serpent x coming in this weekend to do a visit we we'll do some collab stuff you guys will like to see that wanted to bring you guys some fresh content with another creator and let's take a step out This is fun doing this solo, my dudes. Now let's go inside the container. And this is the one we got going on here. You guys can see on this setup here, this was really set up for a 360 S19s or the micro BTs. Now these are C19 cables. We have splitters that will take this from the C19 to two C13 cables for S19J Pros. And then we got a a wall here that the s19s will slide up and will cut out into this this is the hot lane on this side and you can see that it's going all the way up to the top there and this keeps it from you know the the heat coming back through it actually shields it pretty well and keeps that all going through for the 21 fans that you see back there now we'll do a we'll open up this other side there is a panels that are holding this on and we need to take those off to be able to get back there. And we'll do that when I have actually some support here and take you guys through that. But we have 800 amp panels here. So there's three 800 amp panels and the setups that we have here allow for us to control each individual one of these with breaker boxes that are inside this. You know, this is Schneider Easy Logic controllers to be able to see the stuff. And then again, just straightforward. These containers aren't that complicated here. Um, there's just a lot of effort to get everything kind of arranged and prearranged for this, for you guys, you guys can see this. Now, this container is a Wattam container and we also have a black box container on the way too. So setups that we'll be able to show you guys as we go through the configuration and setup here in this container. Now you got lighting here, we got fan controllers for those big you know, 37,000 CFM fans. And then we got some cleanup to do. I mean, this thing did come across the ocean and it's got a little little staining back here that we're gonna clean up, you know, any kind of dirt. One thing about having containers outside, you got NEMA filters here, and then you got these little swing up awnings to help protect against, you know, rainwater coming in, along with these, these little uh, louvers that you see here. Now, we're gonna test some of these filters just to see how they handle it. More than likely, we're gonna adjust these filters out and change them. There's these little swing arms here, we'll put wing nuts here and flip this up and be able to take this whole cage out and then be able to switch the filters out. But, you know, for the initial test, checking these filters and then, then seeing if, you know, it works. I mean, this is a lot of green fielding, which is what that's called. When you're starting something kind of fresh and new, you kind of do some iterations of it and you see what works and then make adjustment. But I wanted to make sure that you guys had some exposure to the container inside and some high quality video with it before we get it kind of set up. Now we're back in BBT East and taking a look at what else we got coming for you guys. All right, we're back inside. So the team, like again, thanks for everybody that reached out for uh, supplying some art with us. We're working with a few people. Again, we, we still should have some room for any of you artists out there that have Bitcoin related crypto art 
you know, it could be a range of different crypto things. Um, we're going to be putting that up there and highlighting some of your guys' work. So reach out to us. And then we have a couple more builds here for you guys, one right after another. This is going to be not just me doing this. This is going to be BBT Ray and Cole is going to go through and take you guys through a couple of the builds that we've just done. So these are 6700s. We've got this little, little green rig, trying some different colors out again. A nice new fresh Red Devil rig here. I believe these are 5700s. Red Devil style, 1200 watt power supply. Just picking up, we're getting some decent deals. Graphic card deals have started, you know, started coming back because there's some of that attrition that happens in this space when profitability goes down. Again, this is gonna be kind of shared content between myself and BBT Ray and BBT Cole as we start to pull them into the loop on bringing you guys some good content. So hopefully you guys like to see that kind of container. I cannot wait to get that thing lit. Now we have four of them to light um, and then get those S19s in there and plugged in. So make sure you guys are liking, subscribing. I mean, there's, I keep telling you, there's a lot of content coming. And I know this is the second video I've given you guys like that, but there is, I promise. We're working through a new editor. Um, we have a couple different options here from an editor standpoint. So you guys might see a couple different style changes on it, but we'll see. Um, and then we have something amazing coming up at the end of the month for you guys. Um, and I can't wait for that too. So an update to the BBT rap song, the very first video we have, if you haven't go, went and checked that out, we're getting an updated few verses on that and going to give it a 2022 style update and possibly a music video with it. But let me know what you guys think in the bottom and uh, can't wait to see you guys. Peace.